Today we will explain how works computer vision. Let's start. What is computer vision? Computer vision is the process of using computers to interpret and understand digital images. It is a rapidly growing field that is being used in a variety of industries, from medical diagnosis to self-driving cars. Computer vision is made possible by advances in artificial intelligence and machine learning. These technologies are allowing computers to learn how to detect and recognize patterns in images. This article will explore the history of computer vision and its applications. We will show some examples of using Python with OpenCV and by Torch. Python is the most supported language in this field. However, we can do all operations in different languages. How computer vision works To prepare images in many cases we need to fix distortion. Distortion is defamation cases by the camera. Fix that we can use by using chessboard, IUCO, markers. Both are set in a camera to know real geometry. After fixing that we can make later manipulations. There are two types of manipulation and recognition images. Image filters, used in OpenCV, there is a mostly mathematical operation on the image, that is represented by an array of points with colors. Ache if we know we get images of plants, we remove the background and detect edges we can assume that all objects with ovals shape should be leaves so we can detect inconsistencies in color, shape, etc. Deep learning AI, this is image recognition and manipulation based on AI. It's based mostly on unsupervised learning, which means AI may learn how to identify object based on many images that show that object. Combining these two methods gives really nice effects. Image manipulation can prepare a base for AI analysts or can show some obvious inconsistencies. Deep learning is great however it takes a lot of process power and takes a lot of time and needs a database to learn. But it's important to have the similar condition for deep learning. Applications of computer vision Operations on image Edges detection, detect bigger color gradient Geometry recognizes, detect the shape of the edges. Color extractor, select only the layer with the color. Change contrast and brightness. Background subtraction. And more. AI operations. Classification, this is a process that set up the type of the finder object. Object detector, here is checking if the object is detected. Localization, here it's checking where the object is on the image. All these methods are based on deep learning uses model that use a convolutional layer. Steps And samples In basic form, deep learning only identifies if an object exists and what its classification. To make localization and identify positions we use tools like YOLO library and divine images to little parts and there identify in what part of the image it's possible to detect an object. The future of computer vision. Computer vision is an intensive progression field. It's a huge demand for self-driving cars, medical, big data analysis, and more. Still, it's many difficult cases to use that aren't easy to solve, like different angles, light, detect many objects in one image. Still, it's a problem to detect if something is small or far. This might be solved by camera 3D which is just a pair of cameras that imitate human sight, but this means that we have more data to process. Many of these cases can be solved by using different sensors like LiDAR or radar, and that is the reason why modern solutions often have combinations of many sensors. In conclusion, to use computer vision most effectively, one should understand the limitations of the technology and be aware of the various ways it can be applied. Additionally, it is important to have a clear vision of what you want to achieve with computer vision and be patient when implementing it. Finally, always test and evaluate your results to ensure that you are achieving the desired outcome. Where do you see the most needed area to use computer vision? 
leave the like, comment and subscribe, and share it with friends that want to improve programming skills. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.